At work in extractive capitalism, writes Marjorie Kelly, is a whole lot more than just personal greed. It's an entire worldview, a habit of mind so pervasive as to be invisible, she writes. We can see pro-capital bias as akin to sex or race bias, but it's not just an attitude, she explains. It's a whole way of organizing our society to privilege capital and wealth creation and extract value from all the other aspects of life to channel it towards that kind of value without values. What's made invisible is human life, natural life, our needs, wants, and desires. The pain of all of that and the cost of it is growing. But the good news is there is a major rethink underway.